Hello everyone, this is Vishakha Daga coming up with the next session of simplifying the editorials where we simplify the editorials for you and we pick up the most important editorial uh, which are more important from your examination perspective and simplify it so that you don't have to go through the entire uh, article. Uh, moving ahead is the first article that is new administrative changes that are taking place in Lakshadweep. Now it was in news recently that how a new administrator is being appointed in Lakshadweep and the indigenous people are not happy with the changes that are coming in the island. Now moving like back, it's very important that you should see this article like I have for intentionally added this map. So see that map in detail, uh, especially the islands of the Lakshadweep, like of some important islands which was in news even in earlier, like Kavarati. On the name of Kavarati, there is your like uh, sh ship as well, Indian important ship, warship. Then there is Minikoi. Then Minikoi and the rest of the island is divided by the uh, ninth parallel. This is important. Ninth parallel divide all of this. There is Kalpeni, Android. Agati, Amini, Kadmat, Kiltan, Chelta, Vitra. If you, you may not be able to remember it's like many, all of them, but some are important like Vinagram, Keltan, Kavarati, and Minikoi. These are like a four important islands. And if possible, try to like remember them in order. Top post is your Kiltan, after that is your Benagram, and after that is your Amini, and the lowest possible point is your mini coin. So, like uh, arrange them, like if somebody has to arrange them in north and south, like north to south order, then you must be able to do so. Kiltan, Benagram, Kavarati, and then there is mini coin. Uh, and then also remember like the most east is your like most west is your Benagram uh, and then it, it is your Kavarati then Kiltan and Minikoi comes little in straight line but yes Minikoi little like like little come like if you draw a straight line Minikoi comes little in the west so Benagram, Kavarati, Minikoi then Kiltan but do remember the north to south order also remember that ninth parallel is the one that divide the two so ninth parallel will divide them like uh, remember this and also rem like uh, one th extra information that you could remember from here that it is the 8 degree channel that divide India uh, from Maldives. So Maldives is like separated from India by 8 degree channel. Also like you should also remember it is a 10 degree channel that divide the Andaman and Nicobar uh, from the Bay of Bengal like uh, entire other in the rest of the like Myanmar and the other things. So this is like uh, so the certain 8, 9, and 10 degree channel you must remember moving ahead is like what does the article talk about article says that lakshadi which has 36 island i talked about the important island there 36 island 32 square kilometer in the arabian sea is actually a union territory and now it's uh, some new changes are come article declares that the changes are very authoritative in nature Especially, it talked about how the new Lakshati Development Authority, it is the Lakshati Development Authority Regulation 2021, which is giving the very wide power to the administrator. So, administrators having too much power and it says how, because they can take over the land, they can forcibly reallocate people and then it can even like a, a very harsh punishment can be given to them who are trying to resist it. So, taking over the land, forcefully relocating them, these are very wide power given to an administration to an extent even the regulation include that consumption of beef will be a punishable offense and the article says that this is this actually goes against the food habit of people because the tribals in there consume the beef and it also says that it is imposing the regulation like if somebody is having more than two children then he may not be able to contest a panchayat election and anyone can go in prison without a reason which is like a very draconian order to bring so the article declared that this is an authoritative changes and it will have a very many impact. Then it talked about the impact. It will impact the traditional livelihood of people uh, because of mindless regulation. They will not have access to like coastline. Dairy farms will be shut. Their sheds will be broken or demolished. So this is like how it will impact the traditional livelihood. Again, the act also says that it will actually be a threat to the, the other fragile ecosystem. You're trying to develop or you're trying to grab a land in order to build a railway, roadways, but like do the people demand it? And the development should be like what the World Bank report says that development should be woven around the people. So people should be centered and the development should be woven around this. It's, it should not be other way around. You're talking about development and the people uh, will uh, like manage it according to it. No, integrate the demands of the people, integrate the needs of the people. 
and this kind of model of development is goes against it so like remember the statement like this you can always use an example that how the world bank or even like undp has said that development should be woven around people and not the people around development statement like this you can even find in your ncrt moving ahead it says that maybe it is the article that uh, this kind of changes are promoting only commercial interest like uh, and disregard for the people interest so th this is like uh, again what the like un has said uh, an article talked about the admin the motives of the administration as well that this might be a like political first time a political person is appointed instead of civil servant and he's like promoting a commercial interest or political interest he said it is a very ill advice it might be a ill advice political uh, planning to change the demography of the island now you must know that almost 90 percent of people in the like island are muslim so the, the article talks about that this might be an attempt to change the demography of the island or it might be done for the like commercial interest uh, both so the article uh, then goes ahead by giving suggestions now what does it says it says the reason why the ut were craft they said because ut were craft uh, carved because we wanted to protect the unique uh, culture and historical situation of the inhabitants and by this act we are doing exactly opposite you are interfering so what is important recall the administration so this is like this is this is how the article conclude and uh, so like uh, this is like this explain you in detail that what are the changes that had come in Lakshadweep and how you know uh, the other uh, changes like this is not good so you can this is something you can even use in your sociology example that you know how tribals actually resisting the change and uh, the even in your idea of development while divining the development that how you know development the entire statement the development is woven around people and not people are woven around development okay so this was the first article next in the series is that what is happening in nepal so in nepal what has happened is uh, the uh, the country's president mr bhandari has dissolved the house of representative what a house of representative is like a lok sabha any country has two house upper house that is like Indian Raj Sabha where the people uh, come by nomination from the state or any other way and then there is low ho lower house the members come by election so this is called the house of representative so Lok Sabha is Indian house of representative because by election uh, people are coming here so here what has happened in Nepal the lower house or the house of representative is dissolved by the president on the advice of the prime minister and the article says it is a very partisan move it is a very partisan move which does not regard the constitution then article goes about the politics and how it is going to impact india so first it talks about the history it says it uh, like a uh, like little bit of history will help you in understanding the nepali politics and why how nepal plays its uh, like uh, the how it impact the indian nepal relationship now uh, article says ki in 2017 uh, what happened the mr oli came to power and Mr. Oli has majority seats and then other pa political party did not have that like large number of votes. So what Mr. Oli did, his party CPI ML formed a coalition with the Maoist uh, uh, that is which was headed by Mr. Prachanda. So the coalition came. So it was the first, it was like CPI ML and then uh, the next party was the Maoist of Mr. Prachanda. This belonged to Mr. Oli and this one belongs to Mr. Prachanda. Now what happened is like and the, the new party CPI uh, UML was formed and but uh, this coalition was on the uh, like uh, there was but this coalition did not come for free. This, uh, this made Mr. Uh, Oli the Prime Minister but it says that each would take turn as a prime minister if mr oli is prime minister now then even mr prachanda will also be given as a chance but it says the article talked about how mr oli was not willing to give the power not only like this uh, and because of which the relationship started becoming so even in initially india nepal also had good relationship but when mr oli realized he you know this relationship is not going is not going well so after realization, Mr. Oli when uh, when realized, you know, ki the, uh, this might destabilize his party. He wanted to get the domestic vote, and in order to get the domestic vote, he started using anti-India rhetoric. 
so this is the domestic politics but in order to win the vote like what like what happened in india so like uh, a party is not actually working well in india now in order to divert the attention they started using indian politicians started using anti pakistan so uh, so uh, sim- on the similar line mr oli started doing the same now uh, his like his demand for power as was as much that he would not only refuse to give the like uh, uh, the chair of the prime minister to mr prachanda when Ms. mr prachanda said fine okay don't give me the seat of the prime minister but at least like don't be the head of the political party that we have formed in a combined and uh, and be the head of nation as well like prime minister at least give one seat to other person but mr mr prachanda refused to do that as well so mr prachanda refused to share the power with anyone and in that what happened is like it was all domestic politics the politics was destabilized the politics of nepal and mr oli wants to come back to the power because uh, like oli came to know that opposition is planning a no confidence motion against them and in absence of even mr prachanda supporting them there was possibilities of falling of the government so like elections were inevitable so the themselves dissolve the house so that they even they that will eliminate the possibility of opposition coming together and forming a coalition to form a party and in the whole scenario mr oli knew to come to the power he used to use the, uh, use the same tactics which indian politician used anti pakistan rhetoric nepal used the same thing nepal some political parties in nepal use the anti uh, india rhetoric and mr uh, oli is going to use the same thing and uh, which was seen india bifurcated the jammu and kashmir and ladakh it redrew the, redrew the map in which it shows the kalapani as its own whereas Uh, uh, the article talked about how the ninety percent of like border uh, border in between India and Nepal is actually demarcated. That means we both agree, but we don't agree at two area. That is mostly Kalapani and other reason. Now what has happened is now in the entire story, uh, Mr. Oli has got a reason. Mr. Oli got an opportunity in Kalapani. Now on the basis of Kalapani, he is building anti-India sentiment and building votes for himself. Uh, and um, to go in little detail, uh, this boundaries was fixed in eighteen sixteen uh, when Lord Hastings was the Governor General in India, and uh, so this was uh, this was established by British at that time. And but it is still contested. So uh, what happened is the article talked about how India has always committed the mistake of not like acting uh, on time. And even like uh, first there was like JNK became the matter, then COVID became the matter, and even now we call it as an internal matter. What article favors is a uh, key you know uh, the government the indian uh, government should actually engage with all of them do not form biases but engage with all of them engagement can can be a solution so this article conclude on this matter so it need to remain actively engaged so and this part uh, this is the politics i have already discussed in the previous page only so like this was like a two important article for today which i discuss in detail uh, thank you so, uh, thank you so much for staying connected with me stay at home stay healthy and stay safe and stay connected to aq iis